PAUSE IS AN ORGANIZATION BASED IN HOPKINS THAT HELPS TO TRAIN SERVICE DOGS FOR PEOPLE WITH DISABILITIES AND VETERANS WHO HAVE PTSD. AND IF YOU GRAB LUNCH OR DINNER AT DEVANI'S TOMORROW, NOT ONLY WILL YOU BE GETTING A MEAL, YOU'LL ALSO BE HELPING OUT HELPING PAUSE. JOINING US NOW IS BOB STUPKA, THE PRESIDENT AND CFO OF DEVANI'S, AND JOLENE Jacqueline FROM HELPING PAUSE. AND MOST IMPORTANTLY, right. COHO, IS THAT RIGHT? COHO. TELL US ABOUT COHO. COHO IS A SIX-MONTH-OLD GOLDEN RETRIEVER. HE IS FROM THE KIND LITTER, AND HE IS A HELPING PAUSE SERVICE DOG IN TRAINING. Oh, that's great. SO TELL US, WHAT, what KIND OF um, TASKS DO SERVICE DOGS DO? IT'S GOT TO RUN the, THE GAMBIT, RIGHT? THEY DO. SO THEY CAN PICK UP KEYS, THEY CAN OPEN DOORS, THEY CAN TURN ON THE LIGHTS, THEY CAN GO GET HELP, THEY CAN BRACE WHEN YOU FALL DOWN. There's so many different things. By the time they're done, about 90 different skills. Something that has been sort of added to their list of, of tasks and abilities is this notion that they can help people with PTSD. How does that work? Absolutely. So they can actually go in and turn on all of the lights so that they don't have to enter a dark room. They can create Because that space. is a major, major issue for people with PTSD. Absolutely. Yeah. They can also create barriers and they can actually help um, just kind of nudge and make sure they know, I'm here, I'm here for you, I'm here for you. Bob, so they've why, always did, got their back. why did Devani start helping PAWS? You guys have been doing this for a little while, right? Well, we're passionate about supporting local organizations. It, it ties with who we are, locally owned and operated. Uh, helping PAWS is just, they do a great job, uh, provide a great service. We just are, are thrilled to be aligned with them. It's just, we, we like to support the local organizations. Uh, it's our money being put back into the community, which is what Devonis has always been about. They do a great service, but let's not discount the great service you're doing to, to humanity by serving pizza and helping this out. <laughs> I mean, it really is. It's a gift, Bob. <laughs> well, how, how does it work? Yeah, well, it, Tomorrow, anyone who comes into Devani's uh, and gets uh, an order to dine in or take out, 10% of the money that we take in on those orders will be uh, donated directly to Helping Paws to help support their services. You'll have some dogs in some of the restaurants too from well, Helping Paws? We will have dogs in many of the locations at the lunch hour and also in the evening. So stop in and meet Coho's brothers and friends in training. And it's important to know, too, for people that do stop in, service dogs, you're not supposed to pet them. Correct. So you're not supposed to pet the dogs because they are working. However, if you're in Devani's tomorrow, they may make an, a special exception. You'll have to ask the trainer at the time what they're okay. working on. But if you ask and they say, no, don't be offended, sometimes that happens. And we're just working on training them to sure. help the people that they need. I mean, I'm working today. You can pet me if you want. <laughs> <That's just laughs> it's always ask right permission. Off. Always right. ask first. Helping Paws Day is tomorrow, Tuesday, August 1st. You can go to WCCO.com slash links to find out more about the work Helping Paws does. Also look for a Devani's location near you. Every time Bob comes in, I tell him I would like a location in Maple Grove. <laughs> get on it, we'll Bob. We'll get there. We'll Come get on. There. All right.